Russia's health ministry revealed new data on the survival rates of the COVID-19 virus, suggesting that the virus lives longer in wet and cold environments. Meanwhile, Israel confirmed that Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine significantly reduces transmissibility. Our Che min -jung has more details. Studies from Russia have unveiled new findings for the survival rates of the COVID-19 virus. Data released on Monday by the health ministry show that the virus could live up to three days on dry surfaces and seven days in damp conditions. The findings also revealed the hotter the temperature, the shorter the virus lives. It was found that the virus can last for more than two weeks at 4 degrees Celsius, a day at 37 degrees Celsius, 45 minutes at 56 degrees Celsius, and 5 minutes at 70 degrees Celsius. Meanwhile, Israel on the same day revealed that Pfizer and BioNTech's COVID-19 vaccine significantly reduces the chance of transmitting the virus. Citing data from the MyHeritage lab, the Times of Israel reported that patients aged over 60 had 60 percent less virus loads than the age group between 40 to 59. This comes as the majority of the 60-plus age group in Israel have already been vaccinated with first doses at least. Although the results are based on incomplete data, experts say it is enough to show that Pfizer and BioNTech's vaccine reduces transmission once people are vaccinated. Regarding the controversy surrounding AstraZeneca's efficacy rate against the South African variant, the chief executive of the COVAX co-leader, Gavi Alliance, suggested it was too early to dismiss the vaccine. According to Reuters, the chief said there were no plans to reject the vaccine for now as studies are still ongoing. Initially, South Africa paused its rollout of the vaccine after studies conducted there revealed that the vaccine does not work well against the country's variant. Che Min-jung, Arirang News.